one owner car guy, oneownercarguy.com. I might say that again in this video because I pieced it together. But it is a beautiful day here. Everything is just looking gorgeous. Sun's coming up. Miniature horse in the yard. What are you doing, Bruce? Bruce, is, Bruce got blurry. And that's that. And I'm going to do this video. I'm just going to walk around. It's slow. It's boring. It's not really about cars. Spray painting the wheels on that. Looking at the garden, showing you what's going on. And just kind of walking around, talking today. Just doing stuff. There's not much going on. I'm just, God dang it. I hate when I have people use my trucks and they can't roll the goddamn windows up in them. It's just ridiculous. I don't understand it. And then it sits out here in the dust, gets stuff all in it. Thank God we closed it on the pressurized cab. But this is ridiculous. I just detailed this. I want my windows down. What's wrong, people? Okay, well, that's that. Sun is coming up. Absolutely gorgeous day. And here we go with the video. Hope you enjoy. One Owner Car Guy. OneOwnerCarGuy.com And I love my alt-right sign. There's no way to program that. I'm trying to figure it out. Yeehaw. Out here with the laughing chickens. And you know what? There's a little baby chick that just hatched over there. I don't know if you can see it. Peeping around. But these guys do laugh. That's for sure. Yeah. It's just an update video. You got the horse here. How you doing, Bruce? And just a beautiful day in the valley. A beautiful day in the valley. And we're doing all kinds of stuff on all kinds of cars. And I'm going to go ahead and do a quick walk around of just what's going on right now. And all kinds of Trans Ams and such for sale. Um, check my website. A lot of it's on there. All of it ain't, but a lot of it is. We got airport lights and Chevy trucks. But we had a big catastrophe on the Chevy truck. The catastrophe is that it had the guy's name here. And when we took it off, he took the clear coat right with it. Sucks. It's unavoidable, that's for sure. I mean, there's no avoiding that. But same thing on this door. And when it blew down after he was taking it off, it went here. And so you had to take that off. So what do you do? It's just crappy, stinking Chevy clear coat. I hate the Chevy clear coat. But it looked really good before. I'm going to try and do a little fix up on it by trying to clear it with the spray can and see how it looks. I just need it to look wet and nice because the truck was beautiful paint. But obviously it had pretty light clear coat, but that stuff was a mean sticker too. That's all I got to say. This thing is being worked on. We have, are yet to get the dash. Cut that down. Like you cut it down again? Yeah. Whenever you got some time to help me try to. So the seat, look at here's how it looked. And he did a simple brushing and degreasing. And it went from this to this. I mean, obviously it's still torn, but if you're gonna be selling your car, oh, all kinds of nice. Little surfacey type stuff. Beautiful car. It's in great shape. I've got all these pieces. There were screws on the floor, right? I got them. They're That's all, all sitting, for this. They're all sitting right yeah, there. Yeah, okay, cool. So, nice car. And this one will be coming up really soon. Did under the hood on it and all that good stuff. Rich actually pulled the beauty rings off and we got them sanded down. I hate when somebody puts that freaking wannabe chrome spray paint on stuff. It's just not cool at all. There's not much of this. Ain't much of that wheel that shows with the cap and the ring, is there? And that's funny. But they sure messed it up by painting it that color. That's for sure. I think they just painted over the dirt. I don't doubt it. It was literally just barely on there. So that'll be done. That'll be one of the last things. Get it all detailed out and pictured in the next few days. The truck, I'm going to talk to the painter guy I know and see what he says because I don't even know what that's going to do, man. He's just going to mess it up. I might try one little spot on the bed first. Look at this, man. These are like little tees all over the side. These are a beautiful set of Toyo Open Country AT. There's probably four figures worth of tires there. Look at this. This is coming out absolutely gorgeous. I'll have a video of it pretty soon. And it is pretty shiny now. Maybe I'll throw up a picture of what it was and what it is now because it's looking good. Don't know what I'm gonna do on the wheels. I've gotta order some hubcaps. I've got a couple connections I found. This is looking just awesome down here. I'm gonna go back to the garden real quick for the heck of it. He, he got that. 
I don't know what he's wanting. You know how people hide their plates? So I'm like showing my buddy's plate. <laughs> I don't know what he got on that. I'm going to have to ask him what that means. But I've been riding the Honda a little bit. And bike, I've been trying to. My knees are hurting. But this thing, I need to get rid of some stuff. I waited way too long to get rid of a Harley Davidson in Montana. But one thing about that bike. It, oh no! It just barely touched it and it just fell right over. That guy's been growing for quite a while. But let's see what we got going back here. One owner car guy, one owner car guy .com. And I got all kinds of cars for sale here. You got a big old Eldo over here with flat tires, Bricklands, and I gotta show you the part of the hoard. I've got about 35 of these Trans Ams left. Every which kind you can imagine. I've been meaning to do a walk around, show them all. But there's all kinds of classics. And look, I got more bumpers than the Bumper Man or something. The Bumper Man can. I'm here today with the Monte Carlo. And I'm going to be painting wheels. Um, these wheels pretty much look like crap. Somebody had went and spray painted them. <laughs> chrome. I got chrome. You ain't got chrome. So what I'm thinking about doing on these, if you watch my videos, you can get this paint down the link below on my Amazon store. Um, you can get it at Walmart. Their selection varies, and your colors vary a lot. And color is what I got a problem with on this because I don't really have a color that is made for that wheel in Hammered. I have something that's this color. Now I'm like the idiot that put chrome on it. I'm not going to do that. But I am going to do that. The Hammered will give you a... It'll cover up a lot of this stuff. And I'm not going to paint much. I'm just going to paint it right about there tape these off and just spray it and then I'm gonna spray it over with this let me get out the Sun to where you can see this and I actually bought this for the sob bumpers and I think it'll work great on this too so we shall see how that turns out and I'm gonna grab some tape and tape off these nipples like I like I say when you're dealing with the trim cap and the beauty ring there just ain't much wheel left to be seen so that's the deal on that. So I'm just going to, I've got my thing taped off and I'm not going to really bother to tape much off or worry about what's behind it all that much. Hmm. It's going to suck getting it all over the back. Well, we'll just try because I don't want to take these off. And remember, we're just doing this to kind of get that hammered finish. This color doesn't matter. A little corrosion in there. You know, I don't have my glass and it's so much easier to paint something and show it when I have my glass. I end up not showing it correctly when I'm doing the camera. It'd be a crime to get paint all over these tires. I'll give it some time to dry and go over it with the other color. I think that's plenty. There's already some on there from the guy before. So I guess that's a that's a good thing. Wow, that would need to be ground down to be done right. That's amazing. Oh, water. Taking on that hammered look there. Let me zoom up. Pretty cool, man. That's definitely got a hammered look. If I had a spare with this tire, I'd probably switch, switch it out. But I don't, so I won't. But this one didn't get as much hammered look to it. But that's that. 
I just popped that lid off and it's got paint all over where they sealed it. Interesting. Never, never ever seen that before. I think it's about dry. Let me feel this. Tacky, but that's tacky. Let's see what we got here. This stuff does spray on pretty nice. And like I say, remember, we won't be getting a nice flat finish because we've got that hammered look on here. I'll tell you what, though. I'm digging it. I'm gonna call that good and it does look good I like it pretty close to a factory type of a color I think I really do and yes I am putting a thick coat on nice thick coat looks good it's gonna look good with the trim rings and stuff we are done with this bad boy. We are not gonna do nothing else to it. It is done, done, done. I made a video of doing the wheels, and I'll tell you what, it made a big difference. It really makes it look a lot better, a lot more true rally-ish type style. It's in great shape, man. We couldn't hardly find a chip in this paint. And we couldn't find a chip in the paint. But I say hardly because, God, there's always gonna be something you miss. Top's in great shape. Look at this thing. If it wasn't for that couple of ripped tears in the seat, it'd be near perfect. Because we got a lot of stuff in the garden. And this is just an update video. This guy just started growing out of the blue. I'm always worried I'm going to get bit by a snake back here. There comes the corn. Oh yeah, there does come the corn too. That right there. That's just corny. That is corny. I wonder how many corns we're going to get out of many corns i think i read somewhere it's like five or something three to five or i don't know i know we got a lot of corn coming in and she's brought in all kinds of squash and cucumbers we haven't got no pumpkins yet Jeez. what do we got going here man we ain't gonna get no pumpkins this year i just don't see it happening i think she said there was one over here freaking birds keep attacking our pumpkin patch not very cool of them. Yeah, they must have got it. Because I don't see it. Oh, there it is. Wow, I don't even know what that is. The tomatoes are going off. Wow, they're everywhere. We need a little tomato things to hold them up. Because they're just falling down. Just notice that flowers everywhere. We definitely... Got some stuff here. There's another whole area of garden. Is that? I think it is. That's our, our lone pumpkin. But, I don't know. I just thought I'd make a video of this real quick. Garden time, garden time, and all that stuff. Um, lots of videos coming up, but I busted my Google Glass. And that doesn't really allow me to make that many videos. I can't stop working to make videos. And... It's, it's hard to do that. It really is. To have a camera around. I set, end up setting it on the tractor. Driving off. Falls off the tractor. I'm lucky I haven't ran this one over. Just insane. Horse crap all over the place. But actually have been getting a little bit cleaner. Even though it doesn't look like it at all. Um, the, it, it just gets blown everywhere. And, you know, it's just a matter of time. And I don't have a lot of time. The truck... Looks good sitting in the driveway, though, I'll tell you that much. Okay, well, that's a kind of a walk around. I mean, we can walk in the first part of the shop now. But clear out the storage units, we got a lot of junk. And, like, this is auction stuff. I need to make a trip to the auction and get a bunch of stuff. I mean, this is all 
just in the storage unit. So, I mean, it's good stuff to have sitting around for sure. But it's clogging up my style here right now for sure. Okay, well, that's that. That car is just looking amazing. And I think I'm almost going to be able to do the... I got one last piece of polish here. Watch this. Yeah, I got to do the final on this side. This side's been done, but it's got overspray from everything flying off on it. But the car looks good. It's a lot different than it was. I will pop a pick in here, I think. Damn. Okay. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching. I'll have more videos coming up. We'll talk to you. Subscribe, like, comment. It really helps out.